Is there any blood on the couch? No, I think we're good. Uh, okay. Take it easy, all right? Yeah, I'm walking fast. Ow. Oh, are you okay? Yeah, yeah, I'm fine. Just also right. Just go, 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 are go. You sure. Yes. Checking on the house. You're not considering moving back in here, are you? I mean, it's a lot safer at the hotel. I know. I, I, I agree with you. I just wanted to come by and, and check on the house and grab some clothes and just straighten up a bit. Oh. Aren't you going to ask me why, why I'm here? I guess you're checking up on me. No, no. I just got, I got done with the meeting. I was, I, was, I was driving by. And I found myself thinking of you. This is something I do a lot more than I care to admit. I uh, drove by the park, and I remember the picnic that we had there last spring, the one that you insisted on making yourself. Fried chicken, <laughs> crispy on the outside, raw on the inside. Yeah, yeah. that one, yeah. yeah. It's a good thing that the, uh, the vendor at the carousel had popcorn and candy. <laughs> you loved every minute of that. I did. I did. You know, with, uh, with all my talk of divorce, I miss you. Perhaps it's a bit arrogant for me to show up like this and expect you to listen. It's all. No, I'm glad that you can. No, no, I mean, no, no there, are real, you know, there are good reasons for our marriage to be over, and, you know, I... I love you. And no one in my life has ever made me as happy as you. I've been miserable since we've been apart. So have I. No. <laughs> These uh, pictures represent our life together. You seem to think that we can get, get that life back, get each other back. It is, is a really big surprise for me. Well, if you feel like too much damage has been done, you want to move no, on. No, no, no. See, I don't want this divorce. I never wanted this that. divorce. And if we can, if we can get back together, Jack, that would make me so happy. You have no idea. What? I want that too. This is. There's one real obstacle. I know. It's me, okay? I, I just... I'm really good at destroying everything because I have a problem with trusting people, but you have proved to me over and over again that I can trust you and I know that I can. Yeah, I don't want to trust you in the same way. That's why I have to know. If it came down to me and Sonny, who would you pick? you and Sonny there's I choose you every time but there's no choice Sonny is a part of my past he's the father of my children you are my husband and I love you and I want us to be together again so bad yes, but how do we do that we can we can um go to dinner tomorrow night tomorrow night yeah no time like the present. Wait, 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 where are you going? There's frozen pizza and champagne wait, in the kitchen. You know, it's just what? such a great idea, but it's a really bad time. What do you mean, bad time? I, Come on, I, Harley. It, you know, I, I just really want to get out of here. And I had a big dinner, and I'm just not really hungry right Well, how now. about you come back to the hotel with me, huh? We'll have a drink. Just buy one drink. really need to be by myself right now. Okay. Okay. We'll see. I'll see you tomorrow night then. <sighs> oh, I'm so glad to hear rethinking this. I'm not making any guarantees. I know, I know. It's just the possibilities. Everything.
get you to the couch, all right? If you'd have just gone with Jack, man. Like, uh, and then if he finds out that you were here, uh, I'll lose him forever. You owe me big time, man. I didn't ask you to stay. You know that I've been going crazy thinking I have lost Jax. And what happens, he shows up here and, and he tells me that maybe there's a chance and maybe we can work things out. And can I jump in his arms and say, great, can I go with him back to the hotel? No, I'm stuck here taking care of you. I don't want to get in the way of you and Jax. I respect that you love him, even though you don't respect that I love Kate, but that's another story. It wasn't your precious Kate who pulled you out of the harbor. I didn't ask you to rescue me, so let's not get into that right now. It's not worth it. I saved your life. Do you, do you get that? Ow. You would be dead right now if it weren't for me, and I have yet to hear a sincere thank you. You're right, you're right. I, I'm sorry. I, I, uh, thank you, I appreciate it. You're welcome. But you know what? If you want to go after Jax, you want to make up with him, whatever you want to do, I'm not going to stop you. I could drop you off at the hospital. I can't go to the hospital. I, I, Karpov has to think that I didn't survive. I already told you that. I can't leave you here in my living room. You could bleed to death. Look at this. I'm not gonna, don't touch it. Don't touch it. Okay, it's fine. I'm, I, as long as I stay still, the bleeding, it's, it's kind of, it's not as bad as it looks. Believe me. You hope. If you get anything to do, go do it. It's, it's fine. Okay. I can call Jason and have him. No, 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 no. Don't. Don't call Jason. Kate? I told you. Don't call Jason.